Oh, Shepard, what the hell? Get off that table, man. No results. Some of our search parameters may be irrelevant. Alright, so we got five systems. I mean, alright. Alright, let me take one more look around here and then I guess I'll start to head out to those five systems and see what I can find. Okay. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Alright. Still nothing. Alright, let's check outside. I can't, you know, see anything being out here, but you never know. Okay. Guess that's it. Uh, return to the Normandy, please. <laughs> I know this isn't the Normandy, but I went back and um, I uh, watched the clip I recorded, you know, just now of me leaving, and I seen that I missed whatever this was behind this tree. When I was turning the camera, I just barely missed it, so. <laughs> I was like, I can't believe I missed that item, so. Alright, this time I promise, we're going to the Normandy. <laughs> I just didn't want, you know, I just didn't want you guys to miss anything. Alright, time to check out those five systems. Oh, I want to go back there and go back. Oh, great. Really? They're going to make me go? Because I hit the wrong button? Uh, damn you, Bioware. Why couldn't you put a, an, a B button right there? Clear to dock, Normandy. Do you need ground transport? I don't need your permission. Uh, no thanks. I'll handle it. Yes, Damn, I sound pissed as shit. I'll handle it. Why are you bugging me right now? I'm on an important mission to save the galaxy. <laughs> you know, she gonna probably go back and tell all her friends. I'm like, wow, you know, you know that Commander Shepard was a real dick. <laughs> I don't know. But that's you know, that's pretty much. Um, if you were, you know, watching my Let's Play, uh, you know, if you're watching this video right now and expecting to see all the, the goody two-shoes Paragon options, that's not going to happen. I'm going to tell you that right now. I played my Shepard exactly like how I picked my psych profile in Mass Effect 1, which was um, ruthless. You know, I always get the job done. You know, that's first and forefront. So... Whatever I got to do to save the galaxy, that means blowing up one half to save, you know, the other half. Guess what? It's going to get done. So, I'm just letting you guys know early. I mean, I'm not a straight renegade person just for just for picking renegade options. You, like, you know what I'm saying? So, I mean, I'm not one of those guys that only, I'm not going to only play the renegade options. But at the same time, I'm not, I'm not completely all paragon either. I, I mean, I normally play towards my psych evaluation. And then, second comes to that is just my personal core thing if somebody pisses me off or not i normally be cool until somebody tries to screw me over or something like that all right let's scan this like if like somebody asks me to do a job and and then um you know like i go do the job and they be like well you know i'm gonna try to kill you you know versus paying you i'm not gonna be nice to them i'm gonna kill them or like if somebody tries to kill me i'm gonna try to kill them all right. All right. Like if um, like I remember in uh, in Mass Effect three, the ending where Ashley um almost shot you because she was protecting um, what's his name? By that th you know, by that third time, you know, you know where like I told her all throughout the game, like yo, look, you know, it ain't like that, whatever. And she wanted to try to listen to you. I was gonna shoot her. 
I had the Renegade option to shoot her, <laughs> but it just didn't, you know, Shepard didn't shoot her and kill her, you know, so, uh, you know, I thought that was kind of fucked up, but I was hitting that, you know, that option, so, wait, did I do this one? Yeah, I think I just, that's where I just came from, and, um, so, I mean, I'm not like a straight Renegade person where I'm just picking the bad options just to pick them, that's not me, so, I don't care, fuck y'all Reapers, let's do this. I fuck y'all up in space. You lucky. You know, I shit run. Fuck y'all bitches. Ah, I was in the wrong system anyway. Alright. Borsha Labor Team. Okay. Cool. Kinda don't need resources now, you know, now that I beat the game, but it's cool. I know a lot of people didn't like the ending to Mass Effect 3, but I mean I thought it was okay. I mean, I don't need my handheld when I play a game, so I can pretty much put together the pieces. I don't need Bioware to show me everything that happened. You know, because I could, you know I I guess a lot of people nowadays must be stupid or something. Well I don't want to really call it stupid, it's just they expect too much. You know what I'm saying? And I think that could be the problem. Like, I thought, don't get me wrong, like, I seen, like, the extended, you know, the extended cut thing. It was cool. I mean, I felt that that should have that should have been in the game to begin with. Don't get me wrong. I, I felt the ending was kind of um, abrupt, if you know what I mean. But as far as, like, um, the ending in general, like, a lot of people didn't like the three choices ending. I thought that was pretty cool. I mean, I felt that it was kind of like a cop out, but I can understand it. You know what I'm saying? I didn't need my handheld as far as trying to understand what the ending was. I don't need every plot hole filled in because I can guess what happens, you know, myself. So, and um, the ending to me, it was cool. I mean, I didn't outright hate it. And because to me, I look at the overall big picture. I'm not just, I'm not one of those kind of gamers who the ending can make or break their whole experience of it. Like, I know my brother's like that, so... Whereas me, I look at the whole experience of something, not just the ending. I don't blame Bioware for the Mass Effect 3 ending. I blame EA. Because, you know, the game was probably pushed back a little bit, you know what I'm saying? They didn't, you know, give them the time they needed to flesh it out. And plus, by this being the last you know, let's say Shepard Mass Effect game, you know what I'm saying? I know EA wants to continue the franchise because it makes money, so they have to end it on an open-ended note to, that way, future development teams or anybody who picks up the Mass Effect universe when EA decides to make Mass Effect 4 or whatever spinoff games they decide to make can make whatever they want and still have it fit in the overall story. So, I mean, I, you know, I can understand that. I, was, I wasn't mad at the Mass Effect 3 ending. I mean, I felt that it could have been more further explained, but, you know, that's it. That was it. <laughs> I, I wasn't one of those people that bitched about it every fucking day and shit on forums and how Bioware, you know, basically raped my imagination because they didn't promise what they promised. Man, fuck that. It's a game. Y'all have fun with it. I mean, don't get me wrong. I love Mass Effect 2. I mean, it's one of, it's probably one of my favorite gaming franchises ever for what it does i mean it, well, what it brings to the table as a franchise is the shit it's it's undone by nothing else so to me that whole experience wasn't just completely fucked up by like 15 minutes of ending no that's not it i could still I, I could play this whole franchise again starting from scratch if i had to right now and still get the same amount of enjoyment as when i first played it that's how good mass effect is And I, I think the you know, the extended cut, when I seen it, it was like, okay, cool. You know what I'm saying? I kind of, I went to the wrong place. And, um, I, you know, I felt that it was kind of like, okay, I felt that the ending could have been explained better. I understood why they didn't, so it, 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 it didn't bother me. But at the same time, you know, I felt that them acknowledging, saying, Hey, look, you know, we did we, we did some things wrong, and we're going to make changes to it. You know, I'm glad they didn't make no changes to the ending. I mean, they just kind of further explained it. Because if they'd have made changes to the ending, I would have really been pissed. Not, 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 um, not at them, 
but at the gaming community that bitched about it and how they just acknowledged it and just said, okay, it's you guys can make changes rather than just making a game that we feel like we should make. They're going to make it specifically for us. And when you do that, you fuck shit up. That's why Call of Duty is in the rut that it's in right now. It makes money, but it has nowhere to go in the future. And maybe Activision doesn't care about that, but I'm sure the gamers who love Call of Duty do. And that's the problem. Because they try to pander everybody and can't, you, you, you can't do it. So, I mean, I don't even think they should try to do it. They should just let it go. They should be like, okay, we understand your concerns and, you know, put out like an acknowledgement letter. But they shouldn't go back and be like, okay, we're going to change the ending to fit this. No, fuck that. I'm glad they further explained it and they just let it go. Uh, what am I missing something? Oh, I must have went to the wrong thing. Okay. Didn't go to the right system. I was like, wait a minute. I just went there. <laughs> All right. I'm assuming this is the last one on the list. So he has to be here. And plus another, um, I know a lot of things, um, a lot of people who play this game, I haven't watched um, other people's Let's Plays of it, but I know other Let's let's Play people have played the game, and besides um, other Let's Play people, but um, other other people who, you know, every time I see somebody play Mass Effect on, um, on uh, YouTube, they always make Shepard a soldier. I'm like, fuck that. Shepard was a badass. I don't know what Shepard they picking, but my Shepard was like... A weapon specialist, a powerful biotic. Like, I could honestly say, everybody on this team right here that you see on the screen right now, my shepherd does everything that they do. <laughs> a little bit of everything they do. Like, Garrus, my character's a sniper. He, he's a tech person. Edie, again, tech person. Shuts down shields. Tally, same thing. I'm good with the Omni things and overloading weapons and all that stuff. Liara, I'm a badass biotic too. James, I'm... I have the Sentinel Shield, you know, for my additional armor and stuff. So it's like I can take a whole lot of damage. Ashley, she's just a regular soldier. Now I can use every weapon in Mass Effect 3. You know, it's not like Part 1. So it's like, I really don't need none of these people. I, can, I, I have went certain side missions in Mass Effect 3 running solo. Because that's how badass I am. <laughs> You'll see it in a second. Like once, the, I'm like, once they have me start fighting, it's like, I don't need none of You know, I don't need any of these guys. But they help. I mean, you know, they take bullets. You know, I like rolling with, you know, of course, you know, Tally, you know, she's like my favorite chick in the game. And then, you know, of course, the man right here, I mean, oh, you know, can't beat him, you know. So this is like the team I normally roll with. Like I rolled with like all the Mass Effect one with. I switched it out every once in a while. and But for the most part, I run with the same people. All right. Yeah, see, I got the submachine guns and a sniper. That's what I roll with all day, every day. Don't ever change it. Don't ever need to change it. Ooh, and I got six points. All right. So let me do um. Uh, lift grenade. Pointless ass item. They, they gave this to people for like, okay, if, if you know, we want you to, you know, it, you know, now you can have the ability to be a biotic if you're not a biotic. Fuck that. I have powers for that shit. All right. Um. Yeah, might as well do overload. Alright, uh, proximity mine, nah, uh, I don't, I don't need overload either, because I got that, so, yeah, yeah, let me do this proximity mine, maybe I could throw it down to the ground, if I see, like, a banshee or something coming my way, 